Good morning, everyone. Folks are going to continue to arrive, but I want to make sure we get started on time. We have a fantastic day planned. Uh, thank you all so much for being here today for our celebration of food diversity, scientific advances, and community innovation. This is my first time at the National Botanical Gardens, and it's so beautiful, even though it's messy with my allergies, so you'll see me sniff sniffling all day, but I think it's well worth it. Um, my name is Danny Nirenberg. I am president and co-founder of Food Tank. For those of you who don't know us, Food Tank is a research and advocacy organization really devoted to highlighting stories of hope and success in food and agriculture systems around the globe. And we do this with the aim to inspire, motivate, and ultimately activate positive transformation in how we produce and consume food. Today's event would not be possible without our amazing partners, and I want to thank them for their collaboration, their innovation, and their support. A big thank you, I can't thank them enough, the Rockefeller Foundation, especially John De La Pera, Davina DeCooley, Gabe Salazar, John Spangler, and Kay Roussel for not only their partnership, but their commitment to food systems. Thank you to the American Heart Association, especially Selena Ahmed, Sheila Jackson, and Monica Sales. They are equally committed to food system transformation. Thank you to the New York Botanical Garden, especially Mauricio Diaz Granados, Fallon Sullivan, Nina Dowlin, and Claire Lyman for hosting us and partnering with us on today's program. And another huge thank you to Food EDU, the Alliance of Bioversity and SEAT, the Foundation for Food and Agricultural Research, the World Food Map, the CRAV Foundation, Fourfold, Atria, the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation, and Verso Science, Biosciences. So please join me in giving them a huge round of applause. They are incredible. The Periodic Table of Food Initiative, or PTFI, as you'll hear it called throughout the day, is providing foundational scientific and educational resources to map the food quality of the world's edible biodiversity for human and planetary health. And ultimately, it will support innovation that will nourish both people and the planet. It's so exciting to me. I know it's very nerdy, but like that's what makes it so exciting to me. And I, I couldn't be happier to be just a small part of, of being able to launch this initiative. Food Tank is thrilled to be with you all during Earth Week in honor of the PTFI, and I encourage you to learn more about it by going to, to foodperiodictable.org. So again, that's foodperiodictable.org. Before we begin, let me get some housekeeping out of the way. I do want to thank uh, Juan Sanchez for doing the graphic recording of today's event. He's a great storyteller and will capture what we're talking about throughout the day. To make sure we end on time, and we will, because all Food Tank events end on time, uh, the conversations will be very vibrant and dynamic. If I cut panels short, please know that, uh, you know, we, we're just trying to get as, as many of you able to talk to one another as possible, and I hope you'll forgive me later. Again, we have a very packed agenda, and we will highlight the incredible range of projects and initiatives uh, that are happening through the PTFI. So please make sure to step out for bio breaks and to stretch your legs because we don't have those built into the program. I also hope that everyone will share your thoughts and favorite moments from today's conversations using the hashtag food tank. I'm sorry, using the hashtag, you can, you can use the hashtag food tank, but you can use the hashtag food periodic table on all social media platforms. And we'll be trying to reply uh, to your comments throughout the day and interact with you as much as possible.